silver metal and we immerse it in a hot bath of nitric acid with an aluminum wire. What followed was a redox reaction where silver nitrate was formed by the oxidation of silver metal. The toxic gas nitrogen dioxide fumed out of the beaker. Because the solution was so concentrated, the silver nitrate crystallized out of solution as a solid. We then made a solution of this and immersed a copper wire into it. At the molecular level, copper gives up two of its electrons, becoming the blue copper two ion. The silver ions in solution accept those electrons and reduce back down into silver metal. This was a single replacement redox reaction. That was one reaction of silver nitrate. Now this compound tends to react by redox where those silver ions reduce into silver metal. I'll leave you on a different reaction of silver nitrate. It's reaction with sodium chloride or table salt. Let's see what happens and it's up for you to decide. This was Chemistry in Context and until next time, stay safe. Next time on Chemistry in Context.